We're gonna review a lot of stuff today. This might go kind of fast because I want you to see my workflow. Again, I don't do things so step-by-step -step as I laid out in the course. I do my tuning and my aligning and a lot of stuff actually as I go. I do a lot of my arranging as I go as well. So let's get into it. Let me show you my Pro Tools session. This is a really cool song I wrote my friend Ara Mondosian, who is an incredible composer. Sorry if I go kind of fast, it's kind of intentional so that you can see my workflow and make this a goal so that you can be nice and fast too someday. I already imported the track. He labeled it nicely 95 beats per minute, so I already knew it was 95, but if I didn't know that, I would probably do like tap tempo. <laughs> and then I figure out the tempo from there. And then I always want to make sure I find like a very obvious transient uh, moment where I can make sure that I'm lining the track up to the grid nicely. That's not really actually very good. Like, okay, here's some good transients. Like you can see right here, right here, the harder hits are landing on the grid pretty well. And the reason you want it to be really on grid, a lot of times you'll get a track that has all this space in the beginning and it's not quite lining up to perfect. So I had to nudge it this far to the left to have all those transients landing on grid so that when I play it with the click track, that click is landing on the grid. Because if it was off grid, then the click would feel off from the music. So want to make sure you got that down and then your levels. And once you're good to go, get recording. Uh, I've got my lyric sheet uh, <laughs> taped up to the wall. So if you see me looking up, that's because I'm looking at the lyrics. So I'm just going to go for it. I might explain a little bit as I go, or I might just keep it rocking and uh, you can see what I'm doing. Here we go. creepy ooze. Okay, so we have our first take of something and usually what I do is use this to show me what the key is. Open on my auto tune. Remember to go to advanced view so that we can see chromatic and then we can watch as the keys play along. So it kind of looks like the key of C. I'm cheating, I happen to know it's in the key of G. So I'm just going to hit G, set major, and that's good to go. But uh, listening to this part, it's a little bendy. So I might not be happy with using auto-tune for this part at all. Yeah, you can hear that very obviously. Auto-tune wants to snap you to the nearest note as fast as possible. So if you have a note bend, it's not gonna be nice to you. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna decide that V lead two is gonna be non-auto-tuned track. Uh, and I'll just go ahead and melodyne that real quick. And if you're in Pro Tools, by the way, you hold control or right click on V lead two and Melodyne, edit, and then this is kind of annoying to like click and drag it up. Okay, so uh, using my little magnifying glass to adjust my view, I can pull that like this, and then okay, we cut, got our cutting tool, our separation tool, and I'll place my cuts where I want. I'm just trusting that this is the one. This is the take. <laughs> I didn't even listen. Felt good in the moment, so I'm going to trust it. All right. Select all. Switching to my pitch tool. Double click. And let's see. 
So I really want to emphasize this bend here. So I'm going to highlight these three notes and I'm going to go to the pitch drift, which appears when you hover over the end of the note, click and drag up. You can see that uh, yellow line. It kind of, so that would be like a really hard note separation. We don't want that. That's kind of what the auto tune sounded like, right? So I'm going to make it super smooth and let's see. Cool. I want to even see what happens when I allow this like middle note to go to where it wanted to originally be. Cool. Love it. I get a little shaky at the end with my pitch. So I'm just going to drag the modulation down a little. Perfect. I am. This is the same thing. I want to let that go where it wants to go. Lovely. Quick reminder, uh, you can place your cursor at the top. If you're in the A, if you're in the Melodyne ARA version, if you're in the plugin version, you don't have this ability to just select the timeline uh, within the plugin. You'd have to actually select the timeline within the Pro Tools screen. Um, but you can, even in the plugin, you can double click on the screen and it starts playing it soloed with no music, no nothing. Um, so even if your cursor is over here, if you click right here, that's, that's where it'll start playing from. Very helpful, especially if you just want to hear it with no track for a second. I'm not loving this. I'm going to give it some bend. Maybe I'll do that there too. Actually, I think that hurt it, so I'm going to undo that. Okay, lovely. Love it. I'm going to render that. Let's go ahead and stack this part. I'm going to give it a little thickness. Didn't feel good on the second one. to my A back one. Let's do a double. You're going to find out real quickly how lazy I am. I'm just going to accept those. I know that I cut off this one a little too short. But I'm just going to let Vocaline fix it for me because in my opinion, this background is not going to suffer if it has a little bit of a Vocaline glitch to it. I'm going to see if we can do without auto-tune on ABAX 1 and 2. So just help me remember to not add an auto-tune on that. So going to vocal line as I go. I like to do all my editing as I go. And notice I'm already doing my crossfades. Like it's just so autopilot. I don't even realize I'm doing it. 17 milliseconds, one percent tightness. I think that feels good. Got both of my things are on. That would be not on. So good. We're ready to vocal line those. Capture and there. Now let's listen. I just want to note also this track is super flowy. There's no drums, so it is imperative that I have my click on. Um, if I ever wanted to like copy and paste 
which is called flying fly this part somewhere else in the song and there's drums on that part you're gonna hear that <laughs> I probably am not singing in perfect timing so it's just when in doubt always have the click on okay let's jump into the verse everything we've been training for it all coming down to the wire listening to we hear the call I'm running out of breath so I think I'm gonna separate these a little bit um, I'll do the second line second. Everything we've been training for it all coming down to the wire. Set that better. Everything we've been training for it all coming down to the wire. Everything we've been training for it all coming down to the wire. Okay, that felt pretty good. Everything we've been training for it all coming down to the wire. I feel like I was rushing in the beginning. I opened up my playlists. If this is up here, this is like the main timeline, then we can hear it. Everything. But if we drag it to a playlist, uh, we can't hear it. Unless we hit the solo button on that playlist. Everything we've been training. Maybe I'll give myself more pre-roll so I can get into the timing. Everything we've been training for it all coming down to the wire. I even run out of breath towards the end, so I think I'm gonna punch in the end. Everything we've been training for it all coming down to the wire. Let's see if that felt better. Coming down to the wire. Still getting a little warm with it, a little comfortable with the song. Let me hit it again. Training for it all coming down to the wire. Listening. See, I use my hands a lot. Everything we've been training for it all coming down to the wire. I like the every. Everything we've been training for it all coming down to the wire. Coming down to the wire. Everything we've been training for it all coming down to the wire. Listening. Sometimes I just, you know, want to make sure I do a little bit of a follow through at the end. Like, follow through into the next line. Coming down to the wire. There's like technically enough space there that I don't need to follow through, but I think we got it within those four takes. I'm just going to finish this whole section, then I'm going to comp this section. Coming down to the wire. Listening till we hear the call and we feel the feet. That's not the word. Coming down to the wire. Listening till we hear the call and we feel the heat of the fire. Listening till we hear the call and we feel the heat of the fire. It's that fire, not the fire. Coming down to the wire. Listen until we hear the call and we feel the heat of the fire. Like that little st more strength on the the fire. Listen until we hear the call and we feel the heat of the fire. I'm gonna try to make it a little bouncier, maybe a slight bit more choppy. Coming down to the wire. Listen until we hear the call and we feel the heat. I forget lyrics so fast. Listen until we hear the call and we feel the heat. Listen. Cool. Listen until we hear the call and we feel the heat of the fire. Hear the call and we feel the heat of the fire. Hear. All right. Let's hit it one more time and see if we can knock this out. Coming down to the wire. Listen until we hear the call and we feel the Listen until we hear the call and we feel the heat of the fire All right Call and we feel the Call and we feel the heat of the fire Call and Let's just comp this section real quick Everything we've been trying Everything we've been training, everything we've, everything we've been training for it all coming. 
I know this is pitchy, but I like the tone of it the best. So I'm going to just melodyne it um, and I'm going to prioritize the delivery tone that I like better. You know what I mean? Everything we've been training for it all coming down to Actually really like that. Thing we've been training for Thing we've been training for it all Thing we've been training for it all Thing Woo! Training for it all coming down so I'm gonna just go ahead and keep the top one. Um, but I think I liked one of these here. Far it all, far it all, far, far it all, far it all, far. I like that one better. Since these are obvious like spaces between words, I am a little lazy with my uh, Crossfading, I often just trust that it's going to work. As you're getting used to editing, I would say check all your fades, definitely. I mean, I'm going to listen back to everything, and if I hear anything messed up, then obviously I'll fix it, but um, I'm just kind of blindly fading. Training for it all, coming down to the wire. Coming down to the wire. Come I like this, it feels a little late, so I just nudged it. <laughs> And training for it all coming down to the wire. It's a little robotic hitting that coming down. And training for it all coming down to the And training for it all coming down to the wire. It's a little hard. And training for it all coming down to the wire. I like this coming down, but I only I only like the first word of it. Coming down. Which one do we like better? Ah, we're going to keep this one. And you know what? It's just a little hard for me. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to gain this down the tiniest bit and see if that feels a little more natural. Everything we've been training for it all coming down to the wire. Listen. That part felt a little loud too, so I'm going to... Everything we've been training for it all coming down. That was too much, as you could hear. It like sounded like a noticeable drop on purpose. We don't want that. Everything we've been training for, it all coming. Cool. It's four. Yeah, that fade doesn't feel right. Or maybe back it up here. And training for it all coming down to the wire. Listening till we hear the call and we feel the heat of the fire. So I actually, I actually really like that I did this follow through here because it, now this breath, it's landing in a natural place. Uh, whereas these are like different, you know what I mean? So it's going to flow a lot nicer. Listening to a here, listening to a here, listening to a here, listening to a here. You should be calling out. I like purple. I like that periwinkle purple. I like that one. Let's see if I pick the same one as you. Listen until we hear the call and we f 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 listen until we hear the call and we feel the heat of the fire. Mm, I like that one. Um, so I know that H's, H's, F's, S's, sh, SH's, things like that tend to uh, crossfade well. So this is an H. Oops. We feel the heat. Oh, that's an F. I mean, it's gonna, it's gonna fade pretty nicely. Hear the call and we feel the heat of the fire. Felt late. Listen until we hear the call and we feel the heat of the fire. Nice. Is this a little late too? Listen until we hear the call and we feel the heat of the fire. I don't think so. Maybe the fire is in a good spot. Let's try that. Let's listen to the whole the whole take. Everything we've been training for it all coming down to the wire. Listen until we hear the call and we feel the heat of the fire. All right, that's pretty good. I'm going to keep recording. Um, I still have more to this verse. And then I'll melodyne the verse. 
I kind of like melodyne as I go. I kind of do a lot of things as I go. So let's let's keep going. Feel the heat of the fire. Never turn around. Can you feel it now? Okay. Uh, I don't want this to overlap, so I'm gonna put it on a different track, and I'm gonna not put it on lead two because I didn't put auto tune on that one, and I copied and dragged my auto tune down. Never turn around. Can you feel it now? Oh, Kimmy's singing flat today. Feel the heat of the fire. Never turn around. Can you feel it now? I gleeked. Do you know what gleek means? When you're like underneath your tongue, like makes a squishy sound and you can like squirt. Sorry, that's weird. TMI. Ah. Can you feel it now? Okay. Never turn around. Can you feel it now? I'm good with that. Never turn around. The around, the around kind of eh, tuning is doing a funny thing. Never turn around. Let's let's not settle for that yet. I, I'm gonna hit this, but I liked this one. Can you feel it now? You know what? It's just tuning. I think it's fine. Never turn around. Can you feel it now? Because I sing flat. Uh, I'm I'm hitting, you know, this minor second, so when I'm supposed to be hitting the G, uh, autotune's pulling it to the F sharp, so um, this is a spot where I would decide to melodyne because I don't want to try to keep singing it over and over. Um, so we'll melod- and we're going to melodyne everything anyway, of the leads. Uh, I've got a counterpart for this. Feel the heat of the fire, Whoa. never turn around. Can you feel it now? Ooh, yeah, yeah. Ooh, na, na. Can you feel it now? Ooh, yeah, yeah. I'm not sure if I want this riff in there. Ooh, yeah, yeah. The yeah, 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 yeah. Or should it just be yeah, yeah? Or I'm putting this little like turn riff in the middle. I don't know. Never turn. Never turn around. Oh na na. Can you feel it now? Oh yeah yeah. It feels good. It feels right. Um, I'm gonna want this stacked. Never turn around. Oh na na. Can you feel it now? Oh yeah yeah. Do you see how crazy I I dance around and move around while I'm recording, constantly? Okay, I'm gonna put this to. A's three and four, um, and allow auto tune on it. But A's one and two, we're leaving with no tune. Um, I'm gonna double this too. I know I'm kind of jumping ahead of myself uh, because I haven't even melodyned it yet, but um, I don't know, that just feels right in my flow. Feel the heat hey. of the fire. Never, Never turn, turn around. around. Oh, nah, nah. Can, Can you feel, feel it now? now? Oh, yeah, yeah. Is it weird to like hear bits and pieces of the song and have no idea where it's going? <laughs> Never turn around. Can you feel it now? Okay. Go ahead and clean up my room. Did I tell you that? I call this cleaning my room. All right. Never turn around. Oh, na, na. Can you feel it now? Oh, yeah, yeah. See how, like, kind of not good it sounds right now? It's, a, it's gonna sound good later because of vocal production. All right, uh, we got one more line to this verse. Oh, yeah, yeah. Anything that may challenge us better be ready for a fight. Yeah, yeah. Anything that may challenge us better be ready for a fight. Beginning of it was cool. Anything that may challenge us better be ready for a fight. Let's see. Better be ready for a fight. Better be ready for a fight. 
yeah, yeah. Anything that may challenge us better be ready for a fight. It's getting there. I like the beginning of this. Uh, I think we got that. I'm just gonna hit this part. Anything that may challenge us better be ready for a fight. Hmm. Better be ready for a fight. Better be. How about instead of for a, we do for a fight. Anything that may challenge us better be ready for a fight. Split the difference there. Like a pullback instead of a flow or a chop. <laughs> Anything that may challenge us better be ready for a fight. Better be ready for. Better be ready for a. Better be ready for a. I think I like this one. See how that feels. Ready for a fight. Yeah. Anything that may challenge us, better be ready for a fight. Alrighty. All right, let's melodyne it. Edit. I'll look at maybe like one section at a time. By the way, the scrolling is kind of like, it's like not very good in melodyne. It's not just you, if you notice that. All right, place my cuts. Kind of try to notice how I'm making my decisions, kind of like where I think a note is separating. But right here, this is probably just vibrato. So I don't know. You don't want to like put, if your vibrato spans over two notes, you don't want to place cuts between everything. You'll just kind of get used to it. And honestly, too, your voice might look different in Melodyne. Um, so it's just something that I guarantee if you practice, you'll just kind of understand where you're making your cuts and why. Everything we've been training for. Everything we've been training for. This is kind of like a thing. It's kind of like a little baby hill. Maybe I'll just soften it a little. Everything we've been training for. It all coming down to the wire. Everything we've been training for, it all coming down to the wire. That just feels flat to me. Down to the wire. Cool. Uh, let's listen on the timeline. Everything we've been training for, it all coming. Let's get, let's get this guy a little tuned, tuned up. Everything we've been Everything Everything we've been training for it Everything we've been training for it All coming down to the How do you feel about this note? Should we bring it up? It all coming down to the wire Yeah Alright, I want to zoom in on this part Because it's just feeling flat to me Remember holding option while you click makes it slippy instead of instead of snappy. The onto the wire. Every the to the wire. That feels better. It all coming down to the wire. All coming down to the wire. Listen. Double click, double click, double click. I always like fall off my notes. Do you notice that? Listen 
listening to we hear the call and we feel I'm just gonna let this be whatever it wants to be because it's not really a note. It's like a bleh. listening to we hear the we listening to we hear the call and we feel the heat. hear the call and we feel the heat of the fire. We feel the heat of the fire. Let it do its. I feel the heat of the fire. Ooh. Feel the heat of the fire. Listen until we hear the call and we feel the heat of the fire. Nice. E e we feel the heat of the fire. We feel the heat of the fire. That feels good. Oh na na, oh na na, oh yeah yeah. Oh na na, oh yeah yeah. Oh, oh yeah yeah. Hmm, I don't know. There was this like cool natural turn, uh, riff in the middle of his word, and I think my melodining is. Taking away from that. Ooh, yeah, yeah. Ooh, yeah, yeah. So I'm gonna let those notes do what they want. Cool. Uh, that's it for this track. Drag that down. Render that. Done. Um, I just select that out of habit. I, I don't think you actually need to do that. <laughs> right. Never turn around. No. Never turn around. Can you feel it now? Never turn around. Can you feel it now? Hmm. Can you feel it now? What's crazy is that what these blobs are, if you're using an older version of Melodyne, oh, I miss the old version of Melodyne. These curves used to be in the center of the blob. Sometimes now they're not. So notice how on this one, the blob is down here, but the line is goes all the way up here. So right here, we're hearing this note, not this note, even though the blob is here. So. Uh, you gotta just pay attention to the line. The line is what's ruling where the actual note is. So even though I have it snapped to F, it is doing the F sharp. So I just kind of like try to center it within this curvy thing. Can you feel it now? Just... Can you feel it now? That feels nice. All right, moving on. You might be looking at a part like this and like this and think maybe I could be making more cuts, but uh, I feel like that's actually just me singing one straight line. Um, so I don't think I need to cut it too much. Sometimes if you start doing too much surgery, uh, it starts sounding like you did surgery and you want it to sound as natural as possible. So. Anything that Anything that, anything that may challenge us better be ready. Anything that may challenge us better be ready for a fight. Better be ready for a fight. Better be ready for a fight. 
these little like flips into the word i like to usually let them do what they want uh, so what i'm doing when i say that is i'm right clicking on the note going to my pitch tool restore the original pitch center so that's what i how i sang it i'll be ready for a fight uh, anything that may challenge us better be ready for a fight cool fight a fight. A fight. All right, I'm feeling good about that. Um, I would probably listen back uh, before rendering if I were you, but I'm me and I'm, I trust myself. <laughs> Everything we've been training for, it all coming down to the wire. Listen until we hear the call and we feel the heat of the fire. Never turn around, ooh na na. Can you feel it now? Ooh yeah yeah. Anything that may challenge us better be ready for a fight. Sounding better, but we got a vocal line. Now that we've rendered this, and a reminder, if you melodyne it um, in ARA melodyne, ARA meaning this function within the program, not a plugin. If you don't, if you don't render it, uh, Vocaline won't know because Vocaline, Vocaline doesn't communicate to the Melodyne ARA. So it needs to be rendered before you Vocaline. Capture. Yeah, I'm gonna leave those settings. Capture, render, new guide, dub, render. Sure. Oops, I did that wrong. All right, let's listen to that part now. Feel the heat of the fire. Never turn around. Oh, na na. Can you feel it now? Oh, yeah, yeah. Anything that may challenge us better be ready for a fight. All right, I'm excited. Let's go. This is sounding good so far. We got. An intro ooh thing, and we got a verse. Next is our pre chorus. The wind is gathering to lift us to our feet, so we show up. The wind is gathering to lift us to our feet, so we show up. It's pretty nice. I'm gonna get a little more emotional on it. The wind is gathering. the last lyric that felt really nice the wind is gathering to lift us to our feet so we show up Woo! i'm gonna keep that the sky begins to shift it all comes down to this sun. almost i see what i was going for though Love that. I, I like it. So tone wise, I'm starting kind of soft and airy and then towards the end, I'm building into strength. Uh, I'm building into a stronger tone, like, like more roundness, kind of less air at the end. So more strong and powerful. Um, really helps Crochet know this vibe. It's great um, for where we're going, which is going to be a bigger chorus. Let me just be super lazy and use these two takes as our doubles the sky begins to shift it all comes down to this and here we are that was nice the sky begins to shift it all comes down to this and here we are your girl 
girl is animated when she's singing on the mic. Now I'm terrified of singing live because I'm like, oh, I'll look like a weirdo when I sing live on stage. <laughs> but it's probably just fine. Let's go ahead and uh, vocalize this. And I think uh, we're gonna add some harmonies before we do the counterpart. Boom. The wind is gathered. So I'm hearing like a lower harmony. Mm -hmm. I have a cool idea. I'm gonna do a harmony here that doesn't completely follow the same ascension as the lead and then on the second part i am going to follow it hopefully it works i haven't tested it uh and then i'll just give it something different it'll lift it so let's try it out the wind is gathering to lift us to our feet so we show up so we lift us to our feet so we show up got better so we show up look at that lazy editing right there that's it my feet so the wind is the wind is gathering to lift us to our feet so we show up i already forget what it sounds like what was that so we show up lift us to our feet so we show up nice i do not comp backgrounds i just if they sound bad if i can hear that i messed up i'll fix i'll punch something in but we don't need to do all that. Um, let's see if if it just comes out right. Let's find out. <laughs> the sky begins to shift. It all comes down to this, and here we are. Oh yeah, that's gonna be cool. I'm gonna sing it better then. The sky begins to shift. It all comes down to this, and here we are. If you're concerned about me rocking back and forth towards the mic, um, yeah, it's not ideal. <laughs> but but uh, that's why compression has my back a lot because I definitely move around a little bit when I sing. The sky begins to shift, it all comes down to this, and here we are. I'll tell you all the rules. But then you're going to watch me break them. And it still sounds okay. If we just try our best, it will sound okay. <laughs> All right, let's listen back to this. Wind is gathering to lift us to our feet so we show up. Awesome, I want a third harmony. The wind is gathering to lift us to our feet so we show Lift us to our feet so we show up. This, the other harmony moving in the second half and not in the first will still make it feel like it's doing something cool. So, it's fine. The wind is gone. The wind is gathering to lift us to our feet. So gathering to lift us to our feet. So we show up. Oh, she was so super flat on the end of that, but I'm gonna let vocal line help me. I don't like singing this stuff. It makes me lightheaded. The wind is gathering to lift us to our feet so we show up. 
topics that, but that's sounding cool. The sky begins to shift, it all comes down to this and here. This is a not an ideal part of my range. I'm like faking this. I don't really sing like this. All comes down to this and here we are. Like this won't sound good soloed, but it'll sound fire in the mix. So we're going to do it. Ooh, none of this looks good. It's a T, so it did work. You get used to what the waveforms look like. Like, I kind of know what is a consonant um, that I can fade on top of. All right, let's do that one more time. Crossfade on that H of the here. The sky begins to shift, it all comes down to this, and here we are. Lovely. Cool. So, what I'm going to do now is uh, make sure, or I'm going to listen for any. Ooh. The mood has changed. Uh, the light went out, but uh, it's fine, right? Um, so let's listen through the background just to make sure that it is in pitch. The Sounds good to me. The shift was a little sharp, but it's fine. Vocal line. Okay, so we are going to capture the lead. So we're going to get uh, this in time, the background in time with the lead, capturing it uh, as a dub. Turn off the match pitch because you don't want your background harmony to suddenly be pitch matched to the lead vocal because then it's not a harmony anymore. I'm going to render that. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to actually capture this as the new guide. And then I'm going to grab its pair and turn the match pitch back on. So now this will be perfectly in the same pitch as its pair. And now, so now this is the new guide. Uh, I'm gonna go to this and make sure it's singing in pitch. You're probably like, how can she hear that? It's quiet. Um, I don't know. I just do. <laughs> so that actually sounds pretty good. I'm just going to go ahead and um, make this the, the guide. I know the that uh, pitchiness was in the second one. So I'm going to capture this dub for timing. So I'm going to turn the pitch match off because I'm going to dub this to that. Go ahead and render it. Set it as a new guide. Capture its double. Put the pitch match back on, pitch match back on, render that, and now it should be super tight. Let's listen. The wind is gathering to lift us to our feet so we show up. I'll do it. Oh, and it overlaps, so I'm gonna have a ton of tracks now. 
Notice I just copy all the auto tunes. We show up. needs a harmony oh that's nice we show up sky I feel like it's so much louder than the other ones I'm just gonna gain these down maybe not that much does it need a third part we show up Um, I feel like I did a good job on this one, but I didn't do a good job on the bottom one. So I'm going to tune it to it. That sounds nice. Here we are. My brain is working in reverse. I'm going to start with the, bo the bottom harmony or the top harmony now. And go backwards. Here we are. Here we are. Sick. Here we are. Here we are. styling thing at the end that little like Wah. Oh, uh, instead of just oh, uh, oh, uh. it's kind of cool here we are here we are love it here we are high one is a little loud Bottom one is a little quiet. Um, this is lazy mixing, just gaining things. All right, so let's listen to this pre all together. The wind is gathering to lift us to our feet so we show up. Yeah, let's hit this chorus. This is sounding cool. All right. It's going to be loud. Sorry. Here we are. So, uh, this is going to be, so here's my decision-making process right here. This is going to be big and stacked. Um, 
the whereas the verse is like very exposed and solo. So that's why I spend a little more time comping comping the verse. But usually when I get to the chorus, I don't. I'm just I just do a take until I'm like that's the take, and then I'll just stack it because uh, it's gonna blend. And I'm just I'm not I I move so fast. Like I just I go I go go go. And so treat your song how you want to treat your song. This is just me. I'm kind of like just just get on with it. If you're more of a perfectionist, I respect that. Um, so if you want to comp your chorus, but I'm just going to keep it moving. This It's time, a little flat, but I'm going to melodyne it. Um, so let's hit the rest of the chorus. I forget what I write sometimes, man. Here we go. All right. I think that's cool. Let's go ahead and melodyne these real fast. I'm so excited to hear this song in the end. It's time. It's time to be. It's time. It's time to be put to the test. Are we really ready for this? For to be put to the test. Are we? To the test, are we really ready for this? Are we really ready for this? To the test, are we really ready for this? I have this like strain at the end there. I'm just gonna let it be separate, but I am gonna uh, turn down the modulation a little on that and this, maybe here. It's time to be put to the test. Are we really ready for this? Love it. Just because I've done this so many times, like, I know, like, if something doesn't sound very good, I'm like, no, it's fine. <laughs> like, I know, I know what I can make it sound like with a little Melodyne love. Are we worthy contenders? Uh, are we worthy contenders? Love it. That's this whole track. Blender. And this next. Time. It's time to be put to the test. To be put to the test. Oops. That doesn't sound right. To be put to the test. Do we have 
the guts and grit. Grit. Do we have the guts and grit? Hmm. If we just modulate this, it'll be fine. That's in grid. Yeah. It just feels a little flat. It's like a funny, it's a funny spot on that chord. It's very tense. Of worthy defenders. Defenders. Lovely. Sick. Let's uh, render that. Stack it. Let's see what's next. It's time. Okay, let's stack it. Here we are. Let's uh, vocal line this, these parts. Um, just fading. Okay. Capture. Capture. It's time to be put to the test. Are we really ready for this? Are we worthy contenders? It's time to be put to the test. Do we have the guts to bring? It's like, why does that sound quiet? I accidentally turned my aux track down. Worthy contenders. actually feeling like I like this part without harmonies but I'm probably going to add harmonies on the second chorus so for now why don't we just leave it and move on all right so that was our chorus uh, it's a short chorus second second uh time around it's double the length we'll do some cool post stuff okay Let's put some swag on this track. We got uh, we got a cool little post chorus here. Time to see what we're really, really made of. What we're made of, really, really, yeah. Yeah, yeah. That's hard. Time to see what we're really, really made of. What we're made of, really, really, yeah. Yeah, I'm gonna have to tune that. Time to see what we're really, really made of, what we're made of, really, really, yeah. It's so funny. Some, just sometimes, like, certain riffs, 
sit funny in my voice and I can't hit them so well. But then certain riffs that sound super complicated feel easy. Do you feel that too? Let's just fix this thing. <laughs> So part of vocal production is also just like getting good takes. I am, you know, I mean, we're already like an hour and a half into this session and I want to quicken the pace. So I am uh, just kind of speeding through. Maybe I would normally spend more time on this part and actually try to sing it better. But uh, we're just trying to like move a little faster. Time to see what we really want. Time to see what we're really, really made of What we're made of, really, really, yeah Yeah, yeah, yeah. Time to see what we're really, really made of What we're made of, really, really, yeah v uh, I'm going to modulate this entire part Time to see what we're really, really made of, what we're made of. Time to see what we're really, really made of, what we're made of, really, really, yeah. Time to see really, really, yeah. All right, that's better. Time to see what we're really, really made of, what we're made of, really, really, yeah. Cool. Cool little quick post. Um, and then, then it repeats. But before it repeats, it's going to get vocal lined. Yes, I really use this plugin constantly. Time to see what we're really, really made of. What we're made of. Really, really, yeah. It's going to be not a normal just bar over. I think it starts here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's it. Eek. Time to see what we're really, really made of. What we're made of. Really, really, yeah. Very cool. Awesome. All right, so next, we're gonna do hit a little rap. Really made of what we're made of, really, really, yeah. Really made of, we emblazing, what a beautiful occasion, so amazing. I'm storing up my power for a moment like that. What a beautiful occasion, so amazing. I'm storing up my power for a moment like that. You know what? Raps, I tend to just get in one take because it's weird to comp uh, raps. Sometimes my tone fluctuates a little bit and it just sounds like they don't go together. Whereas when you're singing, uh, it's easier to comp. Made of what we're made of. Made of what we're made of. Made of being emblazing. What a beautiful occasion. So amazing. And I'm touring up my power for a moment like that. Feeling my counter run tap before you blink fast. By the way, did I tell you this is for like, uh, like a superhero video game, like you know, go kill the bad guys. So if you're wondering, uh, hope that makes sense. What a beautiful occasion, so amazing, and I'm soaring up my power for a moment like that. Feeling my counter run tap before you blink fast. I think I'm gonna try to punch in and see if it works. What a beautiful occasion, so amazing. And I'm up my power. And I've been, and I've been. What a beautiful occasion, so amazing. And I'm soaring up my power for a moment like that. Feeling my counter attack before you blink fast. Occasion, so amazing. And I'm soaring up my power. The end of it, it just doesn't sound very clean. Then I've been storing up my power for a moment like that. Feeling my counter attack before you blink fast. Almost there. 
of being blazing What a beautiful occasion, so amazing I'm storing up my power for a moment like that Feeling my counterattack Cool, that felt good Hope that the tones flow nicely. Cajun, so amazing. And I'm storing up my power for a moment like that. Feeling my counter attack before you blink fast. Rap arrangement. You're not going to add harmonies, but you can add tone changes. You can add doubles, things like that. So I think I'm going to choose like a lower tone and just highlight some of the words as they go. Made of what we're made of, really, 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 really
outfits. Patience, so amazing. And I've been storing up my power for a moment like that. Feeling my counter attack before it gets in. And I've been storing up my power. And I've been storing up my power for a Maybe it's fine, it's just quiet. Amazing, and I've been storing up my power for a moment. All right, I think that's it. Let's just uh, see if it works. So amazing, and I've been storing up my power for a moment like that. Feeling my counter attack before you blink fast. All I know is how to rise up and light up the sky. Looking down on my nemesis like that weapon too shy. Zero to a hundred, do you really want to know what that feels like? Well, I can see the storm circling now. All right. Okay, guys, I have no idea what to do on this next part. It's like a drop uh it's like a w drop so we could do vocal chops or we could just like pick something uh from the chorus to kind of like throw a little one sentence out here and there i don't know let's think about it well i can see the storm circling now well i can see the storm circling now and it goes like Oh shit, I like that. Well I can see the storm circling now. And it goes like Well I can see the storm circling now. And it goes like And it goes like Nice. I think I like this one better. And it goes like. Cool. I'm like breathing. <laughs> this part makes me anxious. It's crazy. Cool. And it goes like. Sick. I feel like I want to actually layer one more thing on the last line it's just like that weapon too shy zero to a hundred do you really want to know what that feels like well i can see the storm circling now it's like a little higher tone it's just like that weapon too shy zero to a hundred do you really want to know what that feels like well i can see the storm circling now know what that feels like well i can see the storm circling now yeah, it just gives it a little something, something, extra, like K extra, if you know who I'm talking about. And it goes like. I'm kind of feeling like this part might be, we could chop up pieces of this uh, over here. It might be pretty fly it's time. oh not that part sorry this part but really really let's just see where it fits and it goes like Okay, I'm gonna sit down. So what I'm gonna do here to make a cool vocal chop, uh, my strategy tends to be to run it through some psycho effects first and then make adjustments, maybe print it, and then uh, I can do some actual chopping um, with editing. So let's just open up some cool plugins. Uh, I'm going to go with my audio suite so I can just print it if I love it. Let's try Portal. Portal is one of my faves. And let's just audition a bunch of vibes. See what happens. Time to see what we're really, really made of. Yeah. 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 Come and see 
loving this plugin uh, for this kind of thing. Let me see how it sounds and see if I can find anything in Infiltrator on random. Really, really made of what we're made of. Really, really, yeah. 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 Time to see what we're really, really made of. What we're made of. Really, really, yeah. Time to see what we're really, really made of. What we're made of. Really, really, yeah. Really, really made of. Okay, I like something about this. However, um, I'm going to try one other plugin and see if I find something else that I like first. Let me go to my faves. Time to see what we're really, really made of, what we're made of, really, really, yeah. Time to see what we're really, really made of, what we're made of, really, really, yeah. Okay. Time to see. That's a favorite. Time to see what we're really, really made of. What we're made of, really, really, yeah. Time to see what we're really, really made of. What we're made of, really, really, yeah. Time to see what we're really, really made of. What we're made of, really, really, yeah. Time to see what we're really, really. Let's go with unearthed breath. Cheating, telling it I'm doing stereo, but I'm not. Okay, so I have two fun things to play with here, but I'm not going to use the whole line. I'm probably going to chop pieces. Uh, so uh, let me just mute this and listen to the track, see what will feel good. Goes like. <laughs> Like, I think right there would be a cool spot to just have the really, really, uh, <laughs> but I can't sing. Let's see which one sounds better. Yeah, let's do that. Goes like. And it goes like. Alright, 
And now I'm just gonna like hunt through the sog and like find little bits to chop in there. I think that was something cool in the wrap maybe. What a beautiful location, so amazing. Let me soaring on my power for a moment like that. Feeling my counter attack before you blink fast. All I know is how to rise up and light up the sky. Looking down on my nemesis like that weapon too shy. Zero to a hundred, do you really want? Looking down on my nemesis like that weapon too shy. Zero to a looking down on my nemesis like. Yeah, let's look down on our nemesis. Put it somewhere on a grid of some sort. Like. Let's saturate the shit out of this part with decapitator. Looking down on my nemesis, looking down on my nemesis, looking down on my nemesis, looking down on my nemesis. Looking down on my nemesis, looking down on And it goes like <laughs> Okay, by the way, I don't want to take away from the track so much because it's really cool. Um, let's pick a... So I'll probably turn these pieces down even further and hopefully they blend into the drop and seem like part of the drop as opposed to vocals sitting on top of the drop. So I'm going to find something in the chorus that I want to bring around as like... Like a theme. It's time to be put to the test. Are we really ready for this? Are we worthy contenders? It's time. Honestly, it's time is probably the best piece to grab. So let's just see where we can fit this. I don't know. <laughs> And it goes like I'm thinking it goes here and I'm thinking this comes later. I think that uh, this part could be the first thing we hear. I don't want to oh, I don't want to overshadow the tracks. <laughs> And it goes like Looking down on my nemesis Yeah, that's a cool flow. It's kind of chill. Let's see if we just let the backgrounds handle that part. Looking down on my nemesis Looking down on my nemesis Let's get into the flow. I think I'm done with, with these gray pieces. Um, I'm going to throw on a little altar boy. Drop this. Looking down on my nemesis. I 
don't know. I don't know. What if I just do this? Oops. Looking down on my nemesis, looking down on my nemesis, looking. I don't know if I like that. <laughs> Looking down on my You know what? Where is that part? Just like that weapon to shot. I think I want the low octave to not be distorted. It sounds funny to me. Hold on. Looking down on my nemesis. Looking down on my nemesis. Looking down on my nemesis. So let's just uh Oh yeah, I want that too. <laughs> uh, okay, we're done with that. Uh, let's line it back to the spot it belongs. But we're going to trade this one for this one. Oh, uh, I don't know how I feel about this. I don't like that one. Hmm, what if we micro shift it? I feel like that's pretty neat. Let's listen back. now. And it goes like I just don't know where it's gonna go. Okay, uh, what's next from here is the chorus. I think I'm happy with that. I mean, uh, I feel like the track is actually, by the way, the track here is not complete. This is like him sending me his first round. When I send him back the vocals, he's gonna go in after that. So uh, I think that's a good start. And he can play with my vocal chops, maybe add it to his drop in a cool way. It's time to be put to the test. Are we really ready for this? Are we worthy contenders? This is gonna interrupt. I'm gonna swap these because I don't want to overlap this guy. Let's 
let's hit some harmonies here. I actually kind of like the way it sounds not vocal lined because uh, it's like a little more of a crowd vibe. All right, so next, uh, I have this like O section at the end of the song. It's called the back end of trailer music. It's like the back end, you know, go berserk, go crazy. <laughs>
Okay, this is gonna be a cool O part and then I'm gonna ad lib over it. I'm just gonna do this to be fast and sneaky. I'm gonna use this as a background and just double those. <laughs> shifter trick here. That sounds pretty shitty. I'm probably going to recut that, but you know what, guys? This is becoming a very, very long class, so I'm just going to uh, keep it moving. some ad libs now.
That's cool. So yeah, I think, I think I'm happy with that arrangement. You know, we went over mixing and mastering. Uh, I'm not going to go over that now, but basically uh, what also makes me super fast is that I have all that stuff templated. So I definitely encourage you guys to template your stuff out when it's mixed and mastered. I'm going to add that at the end of this video so you can hear the final mix down. Like... 